Hey folks, Josh Karajewski here in Berkeley. I want to talk today about Jeffrey Moore's classic book, Crossing the Chasm. I want to specifically talk about the early and late majority. This is in relation to the technology adoption life cycle, the very famous part of this book, which shows the chasm. Uh, and when you cross the chasm, you're dealing with the early and late majority. He has a passage in here I want to read. It says, by contrast, the early majority want to buy a productivity improvement for existing operations. They are looking to minimize the discontinuity with the old ways. They want evolution, not revolution. They want technology to enhance, not overthrow the established ways of doing business. This is a key to some of the dangers we run into when Agile starts to be deployed into the early and late majority organization. The problem is because early and late majority thinkers want to preserve the old way while embracing some of the new way, you're mixing old and new. You might have old HR policies that reward individuals instead of teams. You might have ancient approaches to budgeting. You might have a completely siloed organization that's really not suited to Agile and you're bringing Agile in. Early and late adopters of Agile are interested in evolution, not revolution. And that creates the mix of old and new. Does that lead to awesome outcomes? Maybe not. Sometimes an old organization has to disrupt themselves. So be careful. Be careful if you're an early or late adopter of Agile. Mixing too much of Agile with the old stuff, that could get in your way of excellence.